A new rollout of e-courts tonight with 10 counties, including Durham, moving to paper court documents out of digital, to that's digital rather. That's right. Some headaches this morning, but tonight local attorneys and citizens say it's going better than expected. CBS 17's Ben Boken is digging deeper into the issues people are still facing with the system. With just a few clicks on your computer, you can now access court records online in numerous counties. But for some, the rollout of e-courts hasn't been ideal. At the Durham County Courthouse, some residents telling us they waited nearly two hours in line to get their documents. The intention of e-courts was completely different than the reality of it. Um, I'm not really sure that it's delivered on what it was promised to deliver. On Monday, Durham County became one of 27 counties across North Carolina to officially use e-courts, transitioning from paper to digital. Some attorneys also telling us obtaining records that would usually take five minutes now take 45 minutes, and the system went down for a period of time. But the Durham County Clerk of Superior Court says the first implementation went better than expected. We've heard quite a few horror stories over the months that it's been rolling out, just the processes being slowed down and people not, you know, quite being ready. So all things considered, I think we have definitely handled it with, with style and grace. A statement from Durham County District Attorney Satana DeBerry reads in part, as with any big change, there will be an adjustment period, and as a result, there may be wait times in court and courthouse offices. We are all working hard to make this transition as smooth as possible. I do think it's a learning curve. Um, and so we're all going to have to work together to learn the system and to get proficient with it. But I think in the long run, it'll be it'll be good for everybody. The D.A. tells us the court moves slower than usual, but officials hope the transition gets easier and more efficient. E-Courts is here to stay and we got to make the best of what we've been given so far. But it's definitely going to be an interesting next few months. In Durham, Ben Boken, CBS 17 News.